Here's Fox 5's Kelly Price with a look at the menu at Augusta National. Well, we all know the Masters is a tradition like no other, but yeah, the golf is great, but so is the food here at Augusta National. I know March Madness just ended, but we've got a little Masters Madness that we're going to talk about. I have a little bracket here on paper because we don't have technology here out at Augusta National. We're going to talk about the best food that you can get at Augusta National. We've got some heavyweight matchups. Let's go see what everyone thinks. The prices here are so low. You can get something really cheap, really under two or three dollars. That's really delicious. You can see here we've got the egg salad sandwich, the pimento cheese sandwiches. Those are our top seeds, as you can see. The Masters is playing along. They put that in there for us. So we're going to see what people think. at that bracket and I think this is where we'll get a nice fancy graphic yep there we go thanks for the technology assist guys as you can see a monster blue blood matchup in the very first round egg salad versus pimento cheese uh, yeah it's good yeah it's, uh, it's it's different to what we have back in the UK but uh, it's um yeah it's nice yeah it's uh, it's, it, it's different from an English fry up but um, yeah it's doing the trick that wasn't exactly selling me on the pimento cheese Sammy as a first timer so I had to find a table where a pimento patron was going head to head with an egg salad fan. Oh, I like the egg salad. Oh, it's no. it's, it's got to be. It's awfully good. Awfully Delicious. Good. Heavyweight matchup. I, 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 to, I told my son that I'm going to eat four of these today. <laughs> How many of those are you going to eat? Maybe five. Oh. Oh. The egg salad supporters made a case. Excellent. What's so good about it? I think it's the scenery. Make just being better. here, but it's a good sandwich. But this is a neutral site matchup. Both sandwiches are literally on the same playing field. That being said, this one went down to the wire with pimento cheese advancing on a buzzer beater. On to the other matchup in the sandwich region, barbecue sandwich versus Masters Club. Big barbecue guy. Just originally I'm from Austin, and like, I can't go a week without it. I need something barbecue flavored in my life. Really a morning. I'm, I'm really enjoying it. Yeah, we, we're already double fisting, and it is 10.45. Beer for breakfast. <laughs> Sold them straight up. And barbecue I'm, sandwiches. I made them a promise. It was going to happen. And based on my practice round polling, no love for the Masters Club. Barbecue punches its ticket to the final four, aided by a key assist from those $5 beers in clutch time. Onto the breakfast region, the chicken biscuit going up against the breakfast sandwich. So obviously we destroyed the chicken biscuit. The, the, the what biscuit were the thoughts? Good. It was a solid biscuit. Very good. You know, definitely worth the $2. More than happy. Glad they're here. Glad I didn't miss out yesterday. So there was breakfast sandwiches as well on the menu. Why did you go with the chicken biscuit? I live in Atlanta. I eat a chicken biscuit. Clearly, chicken biscuit rolls to the final four. Finally, a clash between two desserts. Georgia peach ice cream sandwich pitted against its in-state rival, Georgia pecan caramel corn. <laughs> All right, what's your first thought? Sandwich. Taste the peach. Taste the peach. It's peach tasting for sure. Oh, yes, it's good. Very yeah. good. Oh, yeah, those are Georgia peaches. Oh, they yeah. said they weren't going to have peach ice cream. So maybe they have, you know, where you just eat it, but the ice cream sandwiches they have, and they are delicious. Okay, so it does live up to the hype in there. It does, it does. It wasn't a statement win, but the ice cream Sammies survived and advanced. The pimento cheese sandwich was lifted by a 20-year vet in its final four bout with BBQ. So how many times have you had this pimento cheese sandwich? Um, I probably had... 50 or 60. I'll have two today. I'll be here all day. I'll have two. Pimento onto the ship. My concession sources shared a detailed scouting report on the ice cream sandwiches, but the problem was it didn't have the depth. The sweet was sold out every day by lunchtime and couldn't compete with the chicken biscuit. I hate to tell them, but way better than the cheese thing. Oh. That's I know that's sacrilegious, but... <laughs> Perhaps a spicier take than a PGA player saying a live guy should win the green jacket. But alas, that was a freezing cold take. Well, I've tried them all, and unlike the real-life March Madness tournament, Masters Madness is going to end with the number one overall seed, the pimento cheese sandwich, taking the cake. Delicious, but can anything taste bad if you're an amen corner? Sweet tea is sweeter, everything's delicious here at Augusta. For Good Day Atlanta, I'm Kelly Price.